Bake your own cake, Una. And happy birthday, Una. Finally. And Una hates children. Well, isn't that lovely? I'm glad she's not the heir. Hi, this is Charity, and welcome back to the 100 Baby Challenge, where we race against an NPC family, the Munch family. They still have six kids, but unfortunately, the mother has passed away, so Wolfgang will need to get a new wife. What I plan to do, however, is just leave all of the children in the house and see who gets married first. And whoever gets married first, they can continue on the 100 babies. So right now we're trying to get satisfaction points. And why did this child steal my book? You took my book. Put it back. I had it there on the table. And for some reason, the toddler picked it up like she was going to put it away. But she can't. Great. I have to buy another book now. She stole my book. I don't know what The Sims' obsession is with putting away books. But if there's a book out, they all have to rush to be the first to put it away. And it's just so annoying. All right. Right now, Lilith is working on repairing herself. And she needs to go to bed. Then Luna really doesn't have anything to do right now. Now, so she's running the yard sale, trying to earn some more small lands. And then Paris will hopefully finish this book. And no, you cannot sit there. Lilith needs to go to sleep. Go sit on your own bed. Oh, don't tell me I'm going to have to interrupt your reading for this. Okay, no, I just have to make you get up. Sit there, thank you. And for my 100 baby challenge, I actually do daily quests. And depending on the result, if we win, we get to increase our simoleons by a certain percentage from zero to 100. And if we lose, we decrease our simoleons by that percentage. So for today, we need to play guitar for tips and earn at least 200 simoleons. And I have tried this before. It doesn't really work that well because unfortunately you don't earn enough money from tips. So what I'm going to do this time, I think, is one, get started early because it's Sunday and no one has school. And two, allow them all to play for tips because they're all able to play the guitar. Last time, I think I only had one adult and only well I only had one servo and the teenagers are able to play the guitar whereas the children are not I think Una and Paris were both children at the time so we'll go do that as soon as Paris finishes reading this book actually I might wait until after all of the plants are ready because I think they actually grow at about 5 or 6 a.m that's when they produce fruit so I want to be sure that they get the opportunity to get up to excellent. All right, we finished that werewolf book. And now all we have to do is experience a full moon. All right, time to harvest the plants. And can I evolve any of these? Looks like no. They're close. At least some of them are. Okay, it's the waning gibbous moon. And I did not get credit for experiencing a full moon. That is not fair. Full moons don't come off very often, do they? Okay, the next full moon is next Sunday. Um, that's not really fair. I think I'm just going to cheat that one. Oh, wow, look at that. We feel, finished the werewolf initiate step. Okay, so we're going to be a lone wolf, unfortunately. So we have to level up to Apex, unleash the beast, spar with werewolves, and defeat Greg. Oh, that's going to be terrible. That's all we get is one more level. Really? I have not done these werewolves aspirations before but defeating Greg that is really hard and she really didn't even get that much satisfaction points from that so yeah we've got a long ways to go we also have to get this junk food fiend uh, I'm not sure how long that will take but we do have it in progress and then Una does have the single and loving it lifestyle in progress she has a single and loving lifestyle in progress and the people person in progress. And she's already earned outdoorsy. So those are going to be her three lifestyles. All right, let's get a couple of guitars. I already had one, but I suppose we should get two more. Oh, and Loki is eating. Okay, Loki, hurry up and finish your food. And then we're going to go out and play some guitar. Well, here we are at the Pink Flamingo Nightclub. Now, I'm not sure if this will result in more tips, but we have 125,182 simoleons. So we need to get at least 125,382 simoleons, and I have to watch out and make sure nobody buys any drinks. 
because that will throw off my calculations. And Luna and Paris are not very good. Uh, I think that the robot Lilith is pretty good. Yeah, she's pretty good. So she should get some decently sized tips, but she's tense because she doesn't like the others playing. Oh, great. Hopefully no one decides they don't like guitar. That would be bad. Okay, she's angry, so we're just going to listen to music for now. Hopefully that allows us to fulfill this want. I don't know if it counts because it's the DJ booth. Do we have another radio in here? Probably not. Why is there no other radio in here? <laughs> Who built this? Okay, she's not getting credit for that. I'm not sure if that counts as a radio or not. Ooh, we got a whopping four simoleons. At least one of us is getting some tips. And no one is watching or, or paying attention to Lilith, and she's the one with the most skill. Although I guess she's embarrassed, so maybe she's not playing as well. Why does Lilith's music embarrass her? I would think that the other people would be embarrassed because she's not, they're not that good. But why is Lilith embarrassed? Oh no, you're not going to attempt to swipe anything. Okay, if you swipe something, make sure you swipe something that is not in sight of someone else. I don't want you to be more embarrassed. No, you're not ordering a drink, Lilith. Okay, that's better. Now we have no bad music being played. Okay, Una wants to chat with Lou, so we'll get to him to come over so that we can get that want out of the way. You didn't talk to him. Why are you going over there to practice debate? Okay, now she wants to become friends with Megumi, but aren't we already friends? Oh, actually, we're not. Okay, I wonder if it counts if you do it on Social Bunny. I gotta check that out. Okay, she's a friend. Oh, man. It didn't complete it. I think that's what happens. I had to talk to her, maybe? Oh, is she already here? Yes, she's already here. Okay, well, let's go talk to her. I think they're kind of stuck on the ladder, though. What happened up here? Yeah, I know this place is bugged, but it's because I wasn't allowed to use stairs because the owners are afraid of stairs. So I built platforms going up to each floor but platforms only work going up to the base floor going up over a foundation you can't go from the first floor to the second floor on a platform unfortunately no don't leave you have to have a stair or a ladder and i don't know why it's just that way okay now this better counts me talking to you when we're not friends oh somebody else is telling jokes no boo get off the stage oh don't go home it only counts if, if I talk to her and become friends with her. I don't know why it doesn't count on Social Bunny. No, we're not saying goodbye. You're going to stay here until I get my want shown. No, you're staying. Why does it take so long to become friends just chatting to someone? Worst part about this is I can't ask her to hang out. Okay, we're friends. Okay, I got credit for it. You can leave now. Go ahead, leave. Okay, now she wants to play any instrument. We can do that. Well, I think that was our 200 Smolians. I think it was 358 that we were looking for. Um, I should really write these things down because I don't remember them. All right, now she wants to be alone. Um, that's going to be a little bit of a problem. Maybe we should leave now. Okay, everyone wants to listen to music. Well, Paris is about to go into werewolf form again. So maybe we'll try and let her get her transformation mastery by being in here in this small little room where she can't get out. Okay, we can feel the love again with Loki. So that'll be another boost to our satisfaction points. And we have 3,855, which means this will get our next reward trait. And we'll go with super green thumb because that'll help us get our excellent plants a little bit faster. Now, I don't think it pays to have two companions because it doesn't seem like I can... Oh, yes, I can feel the love with Bubblegum. I just have to pay attention to them once in a while. It won't let you feel the love right away. You have to do something else first, and then you can feel the love. But I get more satisfaction from Loki because I think he's loyal. Or she. Loki is... Oh, this is going to mess me up so much. So, Loki is actually a girl and for some reason i just think of loki as a boy name because loki is the norse god of mischief and that just sounds like a, a male name to me even though there is a female form of loki on the new series and then bubblegum for some reason i think that that one is female but i think he's actually a male yeah he's a male and then loki is the female i gotta keep that straight 
oh, we can finally enter a tournament. Uh, I don't think that you're in a really good mood to enter a tournament, but it's a want, so we'll try it, even though it's only 25 satisfaction. For some reason, that's what she wants to do. And she wants to also become friends with Envy. Okay, so I need to get Envy over here. Come on, feel the love. Why are you stuck? We just have one more reward trait to earn with Una, and that is Professional Slacker. Okay, I'm not sure how you can get the Enjoying Solitude Moodlet by spending time alone. Unfortunately, you have too many visitors over at this time, so maybe we can just go to bed and get something else later. Oh, the robot really needs to go to bed too. All right, so it's the end of the day, and we had 129,586 simoleons. And we roll, and we get 89%. Wow. So that gives us another 115,332 simoleons for a total of 244,918 simoleons. All right, the next quest is to discover mermaids, which means we have to befriend a mermaid after we find one and get them to admit that they're a mermaid. I guess we will go to Solani after this. All right, I need you to come here and repair yourself. Why are you awake? Did the toddler wake you up? Why is the toddler waking you up? Go to bed. Okay, I'm going to have Paris go to sleep, but I think she's going to rampage tomorrow morning very early. These toddlers keep... Okay, you're hungry. Okay, well, let's put you in the high chair then. Asamu came over just so I could take care of his kids. I know he did because there's no way that he came over to help me take care of an infant because we don't have an infant. We don't even have a toddler. So we are doing more work for him than he is for us. Oh, come on. Why are you waking me up again? And you ate all my food. Stop waking me up. What do you want? I don't even know it, that you need anything. Go talk to your own parents. Don't bother me. She wants to become enemies with Lilith? Okay. From being unfriendly. All right. Although I'm pretty sure she won't come over because she's a vampire and they're pretty much always asleep. Lilith would rather not come. Okay. Maybe Una could invite her over because I'm pretty sure Una is friendly with her. Okay, and Paris doesn't even know Lilith. I don't even have an option for a rude introduction because she's proper, so she'll have to give a friendly introduction and then be mean to her. Oh no, she's transforming, isn't she? It says, attempt simlish communication. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't think I can talk to her anymore. Okay, well, let's stop and go down here. Oh no, school is about to start and she, uh, we have to take a vacation day. Please tell me you can take a vacation day before you transform. No. Oh well, I kind of uh, modified her in Kaz for her werewolf form and I thought this one kind of looked cool. So we'll go with it. All right, now regain control. Good, now she'll have transformation mastery. But we still need to take a vacation day because you can't go to school right now. You're too tired. And I completely forgot to do your homework anyway. Those stupid kids waking us up in the middle of the night. When do they leave? Oh, not for... Wait. Where's the stay over? It's gone. So that means they're supposed to be gone? Okay, hopefully they're leaving then. It still says they're a stayover guest, but I do not see the stayover. What time do they decide to leave? That's what I want to know. Oh, finally, they're leaving. Oh, Rile Up is listed under arguments. I think she's going to get negative conflict resolution for that, but she wants to do it because she's hot-headed. Oh, we weren't companions with Bubblegum? I did not know that. I thought we were companions, but maybe we dropped too low friendliness or something. I don't know, but maybe that's why we weren't getting 250 from him. Okay, they're thinking about trying for a baby. Okay, sure. Hopefully you'll have too many people in your household that you won't be able to plan a stay over with us. Seems like everyone is doing better in the 100 baby challenge than the Sparks family right now. Now it's Paris's turn to become companions with Loki. Okay, the key when looking for a mermaid is to watch for the stupid 
flipper action that they do. They squeak like a seal and flap their arms. Also, pets will sometimes have the thought bubble of a fishtail. And there's a shell that you can find if you blow on it that will make mermaids actually do that flipper action. The problem is I have to actually be watching and it's hard to watch everything to see who's doing it. Okay, now that we're back in acquaintance level, let's try to be disliked because that's what she wants. It's so stupid how she goes back and forth and she's already disliked. By the way, I don't think we're going to find mermaids today because they fixed the bug where mermaids actually live for a very long time. So it appears all of the mermaids in my game are dead except for one. And I don't see Paka around. So I don't know where he lives. And of course, I had to do this on bear night. So I have to mouse over each individual person to see if it's Paka. But no, not here. Finally, okay, can we stop being obsessed with Lilith now? Seriously? Come on, why won't you eat anything? Oh, whatever it is is over and the food disappeared and she didn't get to eat it. Come on, that's not fair. All right, fine, let's go home. All right, since we didn't find any mermaids, we have to spin the losing wheel and we get 52%. So 52% of 250,507 is 130,264 simoleons, which brings us down to 120,243 simoleons. That's not so bad. Oh, I missed rebate day. I had no idea it was rebate day. Oh no, Bubblegum is now an elderly dog. We have to give Bubblegum some extra pets. So the quest for today is to join a random freelance job and complete one gig. And we got programmer. So Lilith, you're getting a job. Okay, freelancer and we can be a programmer. I wonder if there's anything that she can do with no skill. Oh, there actually is. Maybe if we take a cheap one, it won't be so bad. Desperate for spreadsheet help. Well, since tomorrow is Winterfest, I think we're going to send Paris to school alone so that she can work hard and get an A. Come on, quit talking. Go to school. Okay, that was easy. 133 simoleons. Okay, Paris's grades are up, so now she has an A. Well, I guess Paris can graduate early. Sure, that'll actually make things easier. Let's see if ferocious intimidation counts as unleashing the beast. Uh, I guess that just means becoming a werewolf, though. <laughs> no, he's not impressed. Why do I always pick the one that decreases conflict resolution? Well, Paris really needs some medicine. She's been sick for the last two or three days, it seems like. Well, we get to spin the winning wheel for today, and we get 26%. That gets us another 31,781 simoleons for a total of 154,016 simoleons. Now the quest for the next day is to actually get 5,000 simoleons in loans from other sets and you don't have to pay it back. Well, apparently you have to be level 7 to get even a small loan. So this actually might be kind of difficult because I don't have anybody level 7 yet. The closest is Una is, is level 6. Okay, finally, level seven. All right, there's 500. I guess we just have to do that 10 times. That's a lot. Okay, there's two and three, and that's for taking care of your toddlers. I will never pay that one back. Okay, the maid is four. Now I just have to go around meeting people and asking them for loans. Oh, Paris got the junk food fiend lifestyle. Good, so now all we have to do with her is get another 4,400-ish satisfaction points. Uh, we can spar with werewolves. That'll, but th These only give 50 satisfaction points. It's almost not worth doing. Everyone keeps running away because it's pouring down rain. So maybe if I start a yard sale, they won't be as quick to leave. Okay, and that's five. Hmm, she wants to water a plant. I don't think we'll be able to do that right now. Okay, that one said no. Okay, I get it. I can just ask again right away. Okay, I'm going to keep bugging you until you buy something from my table or you give me a loan. No, you can't go inside. Okay, Wolfgang is saying no too. Okay, this is not as easy anymore. Okay, there's number six. Okay, and Santa is seven. And that's eight. 
If she would quit slipping in that puddle, every time she walks by, she slips in it. Oh, come on. Yeah, I know you're stinky. No, you can't take a bath yet. We need to ask two more people for loans. All right, just one more. Come here. No, we are not eating. We are not taking a shower. No, of course not. <laughs> the other person that I ask, it says no. I need to leave one more, one more person. Come on, one more person. And it's only 15 minutes till midnight. No. All right, I need to find one more person to ask. Thorn Bailey, no. Um, I guess maybe you, if we can get to you in time. Probably not, because she has to go all the way over here and introduce herself first. All right, technically it is midnight, but we'll allow this one more to go through because she got here right at midnight. Okay, that's barely 5,000 simoleons. Would have been easier if she didn't keep slipping in that stupid puddle. All right, so we get to spin the winning meal and we get, oh, 100%. Wow, that really would have been bad if she missed it. So we have 158,500 and we go to 317,000. We have 317,000 simoleons now. Okay, I didn't get credit for that. The cow plant is full grown. I think it was because I was off the lot when it happened. Oh, that is ridiculous. That's another one I'm going to have to cheat in a little bit. I just need to get all my plants fertilized. Oh no, it did work. Okay, it just took a little while for some reason. Winterfest successful. And we're going to get seldom sleepy for Paris. Now Paris only needs to get 4,000 more satisfaction points, only 4,000 more. And she wants to stargaze with Isamu. Okay, he's not going to come over at 2.15 in the morning. And the quest for today is to get gold on a spooky party. So that's not so hard. Yeah, we're going to have to apologize to Lilith after riling her up. Well, maybe if we have a spooky party, he will come over. But the only thing is she wants... Okay, stargaze. Okay, we have to do it while it's nighttime then. So maybe we should plan a spooky party now. Okay, carving pumpkins is the main goal. Okay, don't talk to Lilith. She's the one making the pumpkins. Oh no, it's daytime and I didn't get a chance to ask to stargaze. Okay, if we can finish this pumpkin, we should be done. Okay, everybody can go home now. We're done. Since we're done with today's task, we'll just go to sleep. Because Paris actually needs to sleep during the day anyway. She still wants to win a competitive game. Oh, okay, and just chat with Asamu. Okay. She keeps wanting to win competitive games, and she's not very good at them. Oh, she actually won this time. Maybe we should just go to Moonwind Mill and fight Greg a bunch of times. We'll probably lose. And the other thing is she might adversely affect her conflict resolution. So I'm not sure if I really want to do that. I just realized that Paris is a teen and she doesn't have the option to spar with the werewolves because the werewolves are all adults. So unless I can find some other teen wolves, I can't spar. Oh, that just... It makes it so much harder to do this aspiration. Unfortunately, Paris wants to stargaze with Isamu, and it is way too late for him to come over. So one of the ways you can force them to come over is to plan a social event, and he will come over even though it's the middle of the night. All right, everybody can go home. Yeah, before you get struck by lightning, you better go home. Well, I forgot to spin the winning wheel for Thursday. So we had 316,613 simoleons, and we got 68%, which gives us another 430,594 simoleons for a total of 747,207 simoleons. Now the next goal is going to be to go to the beach, collect five items, build two sandcastles, and monster stomp one of them. So since it's night on the town, I thought we would come to Sulani and be kind of at the beach, but also at a bar. All right, we built two sand sculptures and we're going to monster stomp one of them. And now we just need to collect some more items. Well, technically I have found five items, but some of them are trash. So I'm only going to count the ones that are not dead fish and spoiled food. Oh, and Una unlocked the single and loving it lifestyle finally. Okay, all we need to do is get to 4,000 satisfaction points and she is basically able to move out. I found a beach towel. All right. Oh, and we got an eye of Sulani. 
All right, that was the last item that we needed. Let's try giving her a bunch of simoleons. Okay, gave you 10,000 simoleons. That really didn't help our relationship too much. Can I add her on Social Bunny now? No. Okay, we're acquaintances now, but I want to get her up to a little bit of friendly so that I can put her on Social Bunny because I keep wanting to become disliked and then make enemies and then she'll never hang out with me because she doesn't like me. All right, now I can add her to Social Bunny. So if I ever need to reset her friendship level, then that will be an easy way to do it. Now I will make her mad. Okay, why can't I become disliked? It's like it's not resetting. The bar is halfway full of red. Maybe it's bugged because we're Social Bunny friends. Great. So now I'm disliked, but I don't think that got my want fulfilled. This is just annoying. Well, we do get to spin the winning wheel, and we get 45%. And that gives us another 331,761 simoleons. For a total of over a million simoleons. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. I think it's just because we've had some quests that we were actually able to complete, whereas a lot of times I will run into a quest that for some reason makes me lose a lot of money. But we did lose one quest, actually. And still, ever since then, we were able to gain a bunch of money. Plus, we've been selling dragon fruit because Una has the freelance botanist aspiration, which gives us tons of money. Okay, I reset it one more time, and this time went to Manage Worlds in order to reload the game. Okay, finally! Now hopefully we can just make her go away and not have to deal with her anymore. All right, this is the last day of the week and we're supposed to get gold on a family reunion, but I'm not sure I even really want to do that. I want to finish getting all of these aspiration points or satisfaction points so that Paris and Una can age up to young adult. Okay, now she wants to become enemies with Desiree. And of course, Desiree is not going to come over. Again, with the conflict resolution decreasing, I think that the ones that I pick that for, it, it doesn't matter what I pick. They're both going to decrease conflict resolution. Okay, why is my only option to cowpoke dance? Okay, it's the actual station. <laughs> for some reason, that one only allowed me to cowpoke dance. I don't know why. All right, finally I completed that aspiration, but it was glitchy because basically just putting the seed down on the ground gave me credit for some reason. All right, and now we're going to get professional slacker. And just double checking that her responsibility is in range to get irresponsible, just barely. So basically she can age up right now. Bake your own cake, Una. And happy birthday, Una. Finally! And Una hates children. Well, isn't that lovely? I'm glad she's not the heir. Now for the aspiration for the adult, I'm going to choose something from popularity because that is going to be her trait that she's going to have. Let's give her party animal. Time to take a photo. And that's it for Una. So she's moved out of the house. She took 20,000 simoleons with her. And I had to clear out all of the dragon fruit plants because we're no longer allowed to use gardening for any income. Why does she not like me? I want to become friends with her for some reason. Oh, she's evil. I should be able to bribe her for friendship then. Stop running away. Come back here. Well, that's the end of another week. And unfortunately, we are going to have to spin the losing wheel. Hopefully, we don't get anything too large. And we have 29%, which is going to lose us 297,344 simoleons for a total of still over a million and 300,000. So if we can just become friends, I can end this. And next time, hopefully, Paris will be able to complete her aspiration points. And she needs uh, like 3,500 more. And she will actually be able to become the next mother. So this is Charity. Thanks for watching.